I guarantee the one digging in this trunk is for violating people's rights. Oh, I'm sure. Guaranteed, it's part of his job. On June 7th of 2020, I attended another protest against police brutality. This is not tied to the protests happening around the nation as a result of George Floyd's death. This protest is done every month on the 7th in front of the Spokane County Courthouse from 12 to 1 p.m. David's family and their friends are there every month at this time to raise awareness about their son and friend being shot in the back by order follower Brandon Rankin of the Spokane Police Department. They invite everyone to join them, whether you're there for their son or some other victim of police brutality. Towards the end of Novak's protest, order followers from a lot of local departments started showing up. We even saw what looked like military police from the local Air Force base. I took the heavy police presence towards the end of the Novak protest as a way to intimidate the peaceful protesters left and others starting to show up in the area for another round of protests tied to George Floyd's death. As the first order follower shows up from the Spokane County Sheriff's Department in front of the courthouse with an army MP in tow, I approach with others from the protest to see what's up and make sure there is no intimidation or restrictions on freedom. And of course, this order follower just can't help himself as I accurately predict. Don't forget to upvote, share, subscribe, and leave me a comment while you watch this tyrant display exactly why these thugs masquerading as heroes are a problem. They think they can give free people, not hurting anyone else or causing any problems, directives on what to do simply because they have a badge and a gun issued by the ruling class. David Novak was shot in the back and countless others killed or beaten for simply not following a directive like this. Nothing else. One of them is. I guarantee the one digging in this trunk is for violating people's rights. Oh, I'm sure. Guaranteed, it's part of his job. A few moments later. Uh, I believe what the truth is, what we see every day. Why does she have to leave there? Let's go, guys. Crappy? Tired of you guys terrorizing our communities? What? Does Gorman sound familiar? Yeah, have you ever heard of Chad Gordon? Yeah. yeah. What do you think about old Chad Gordon? I know he doesn't work for us anymore. Oh, that's good. That's good. At least you guys are getting rid of one of the bad, stinky, stinky bastards that works for you guys. Yeah, the one that makes you guys look bad to others, yeah. even though you might not be. You should be laying down your arms and joining the people. No, I have a duty to do. Save yeah, I know. Follow orders. That's right. Not saving innocent lives. That's not what your job is, clearly. Uh, I believe what the truth is, what we see every day. Why does she have to leave there? Well, then, sir. Bring the fence down. Sir, if she can't be there, then why did you put the fence there? If you wanted her to stay here, this is the idiocy of what you guys do. You put the line back there, and then you say, don't cross this imaginary line. And then if she doesn't follow your orders, you're going to pull out your gun and make threats against her, probably. That's what you guys do. She wasn't hurting anything, and you started giving her commands. That is not how a free country operates. She wasn't hurting anything by being there. How is that free? How is it, not, how is it free for me to be free? Here. Yeah. This isn't that side of the fence. Yeah. This is not. This is no. Where, is it? where does it say this is closed right here, where my son and I can walk right here? Where does it say it's closed? I'm saying right here where it's closed. So she was standing right there. Yeah. So now because you this moved into that property. space, it's closed. You can be on the sidewalk. No. This where is, is that private, private property? property? It's owned by the county, sir. This is owned by the people. It's a public campus. It's a closed okay. campus. How is it closed? It's it closed because closed you guys closed it against our will that pay your bills. Really? What business are you going to do here today? 
My business is coming here and letting it's you guys closed. know that you are killing it's us. Closed. I don't care. I paid for anybody. it. I didn't say you did, but you do not speak up when people wearing that uniform do. Really? Yes. Okay. You know who I am, do you? I don't give a shit. Oh, you yeah. you said it when you got well, here that I'm you are here to fall so orders and you took away her rights. Yeah. So you don't care about freedom. You're not an American. You're an order follower because they told you to take away her rights and not let her stand oh. right there. Right. That's why. That's why we're pissed and that's why we're here. Why do I have to get on the sidewalk? What sign does it say that I have to not be on here? Are you going to arrest me and my son for peacefully being here if I don't? I am moving because you have weapons and you have threatened force against us and I don't want my son to go to jail because you are uncomfortable. You don't need anything. You need to put your guns down and be with the people. Yeah, and you need to like keep your ego in check, man. You're not one of us, Gorham. Did you speak up when you knew Gordon hit his wife, or did you just let the department do it when it came out later? A few moments later. to stand up and make it right too. You can read the report and read what all of us have read. You can watch the videos and see how that, that went down. You can read that there was no investigation. They say George Floyd laid there for nine minutes. David laid there and suffocated for 18 minutes. You guys should be in a culture when you, I don't care if you're a police officer, you're a dispatcher or who you are. When you see somebody dying that's wrong, you should step up! Yeah, see? Public property. We can walk right up to the fence. Why is it that this tyrant said that she couldn't stand up there? Why does the fence back there, if it's... If, if you guys didn't want us to... Just, just hear me out. Just, can I just talk... Gentlemen, can I just talk to you for one second? So we can come up to this fence, right? We can come up to the fence. I'm sorry, go ahead, go ahead, I'm sorry. He walked up on us, sir. It's on camera. Well, don't give directives if you don't know what the truth is. Just say, I asked you a simple question. I didn't ask you, can I walk up? I asked if I can walk up to the fence, and you give me directives. Thank you. That's all I asked. I didn't give you a damn directive. Thank you for correcting yourself. I appreciate that, Gorham. Too bad you had to. Too bad you had to remove our rights and then found out you're wrong instead of just being like, yeah, they aren't hurting anyone. You had to be a dick, didn't you? Thanks for supporting my channel and work. Links to all the platforms you can find Questionable Authority on are in the description below. And there's lots of ways to help me grow and dedicate more time to this channel. Of course, links to PayPal, Dash, Bitcoin, and others are listed. But you don't have to part with your capital to support me. There are ways like downloading the privacy-minded Brave browser using my link below and using it for 30 days, or sign up for a new Hive or Steam account and earn cryptocurrency for yourself for doing what you already do on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter, and at the same time, I'll earn crypto for your upvotes and comments.